All right, this is a guide using this specific team since uh, Traffy is wanting it. I'll show it for him. Uh, you're going to want to make sure for this team to work, you have to have the healing artifact set. If you do not have it, this team will not work. But uh, here's the gear. Attack crit on melee and Escanor. Uh, HP defense on Gother and Deanne. With that, let's hop in. So the strategy is pretty simple, and like I said, this state or this team is only good for uh, stage one and two. It is no good for three, but most people can't beat three anyways. So this is this is a very good team for one and two. So there's at least that. Um, so turn one's pretty basic. We're gonna taunt with Deanne, and we're gonna use her single target, the pump kid bomb, and Escanor's uh, normal card. You want to use two single target attack skills every turn to build melee's uh, damage reduction. So, there we have one stack. We've got pretty good card draw here. No, oh, can't even break the shield. All right. So we're going to DN single target, and then we're going to get rid of these AoEs. We might kill this turn. Yeah, we're probably killing. Yep. Alright. So... I didn't want to, I wanted to save those flood cards, but I'm going to have to use one of them at least. And I'll just move this melee card here. Okay. The idea is you want to get a bunch of uh, melee cards, single target cards, saved up. Four, uh, particularly. And uh, have them all at level three for phase four. So, you want to walk into phase four with four level three melee single targets. We're getting a pretty good start on that. Um, I'll go ahead and rank up melee. This will give us, what, our third or fourth damage reduction stack. Doing pretty good here. Alright, phase three. The idea is just to kill it as soon as possible. So we will ult with Escanor, ult with Deanne, single target with Deanne. And rank up all. Now, for this strategy to work, you do need to have at least a 4 out of 6 Escanor. Um, Melee, he can be 1 out of 6, that's fine. But you do need some dupes in Escanor. Alright, he's going to remove my buff, taunt, but I have another one on deck. He's going to attack Gother, that's fine. Okay, so now we will go through old. Let's move this melee card. And hopefully we draw another melee single target, or we don't. That's fine. I'll just get rid of these flood cards, just uh, buff up melee a little bit, and start attacking. As you can see, they, they patience at level 1 and below. So, melee doing good damage, got to double crit. As you can see, if we had four of those, we most likely would have killed or been very, very close. But, oh, we're all good here. He's not going to be able to hurt Deanne. So we're going to rank up all, rank up all again, attack with melee, oh, with melee, and attack with melee. And this should finish it here. Or maybe not. Almost. It's close enough.
It, it is a bit unfortunate that I didn't draw the uh, single targets from melee to have four of them ready. Really, that's what you want to do. At least three. If you don't have three by phase three, you might want to reset. It's up to you, depending on how much, uh, how you have your units built out and how much punishment they can take till you have the right cards. It just uh, varies. And as you can see, this will finish stage one. Nice and easy. Uh, so you can see it's beatable even with bad RNG. We still did pretty good. But uh, there's this for you. I hope this will help you some. And I'll show you stage two next.